Yo, what's good? It's your boy. Your man's. I feel weaker. Get in. Get in. Damn, I wish I had that prototype. Fuck. Uh, is John not around? I think he is, but I haven't. I just saw him. He's really good about calling when, like, shit is ready. Unless you want to call him and be like, yeah, I hate bothering I'll people. Okay. You hate bothering certain people. That's right. I love bothering others. Right. John, how's it going, sir? Good. How about yourself? Doing well. Uh, question for you. Uh, Bunny and I are heading to meet with a client, actually, uh, about the eye, and she and I were wondering if, by chance, uh, one of the prototypes was ready. Uh, yes. We can actually um, give me a few minutes. I, uh, I'm kind of just, like, getting into the, you know, into the mix of things, and okay. uh, but I will give a call very soon. Okay, perfect. Sounds good. Okay, talk to you soon. All right, bye. Bye-bye. Uh, yes, he is waking up. He said he'll give me a call in a few minutes. Oh, damn. Okay, sounds good. Dope. Yeah. Yeah. Great news. Fantastic news. Uh, I had to put on my salesman kind of attitude and voice. <laughs> Hi, calling no. you from uh, San Andreas Hi. Service. Uh, we, you know, quick question for you. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully not going to take up a bunch of your time. Quick little cute. Um, here's yeah, here's yeah. the thing. Uh, I also need to call Max and tell him to meet us here. But, uh, uh, yeah, just later. give us it like literally like the ten minutes that it's going to take for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Us to talk to doctors and also to talk to. Did not realize that was parking. Like just doctor. For us. Stop. Doctor parking. Mad tech fucking wall. Hire me. Hire me here. I can't. Unless you want to get a job receptionist or something. You don't want to hire me as like a medical consultant? No. Hmm. I wouldn't even have the ability to. That's unfortunate. What? Got here in time for biting. Yeah. I don't like that. What's happening? I don't, I don't prefer it with any of you at all oh, for any reason right. consensual unconsensual no, wait no we went about like a group effort this isn't a group biting session 
What is this? It's happening? A dis I discussion fighting. And consensual fighting. It's just oh, a said he would like it if it was consensual biting. Yeah, it's just talking about biting. We're not Oh, biting oh okay, each okay. Other. Okay, that's... Yeah, that makes more sense. You're just talking about being, not doing thing. Okay, I'll go change really quick. Yeah, that outfit. Mercy, I'll murder you. Why does my face hurt? Everyone. Because I punched you because you don't go in the back like you're supposed to. Sorry, I wasn't really like... This is kind of sensitive. Look, diarrhea happens at one. Don't do it in the middle of the lobby. I wasn't like that, but okay. Maybe you don't do it in your pants, you need to change? Sometimes you can't help it. Sometimes it happens. I love your accent, by the way. Thank you. Actually, you really do have a great accent. Oh, I love thank it. Thank you. I was talking to you, but sure. No. No. Oh, hi, Mer I'm Millie. Hi, Millie. Good to meet you. Mercy, we've talked before. Uh, yeah. I would have I would have mentioned it then. No, you're okay. shy. It's okay. It's not I'm shy. Yes. Yeah. Mm. It's all right. Well, that's fine. What was your name? I'm so sorry. Uh, my I name is you. Sloan Kelly. Good to meet you. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. See, I, I just, like, something about it makes me want to try and emulate the accent, but I won't. Oh, go give it. Give it a try. Ha. 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 <laughs> something about it just makes me want to talk like this now. Well, I'll be. I will be well, a I'll monkey's be. uncle. It is just so dang hot at Fine. So dang. Hotter oh than Basil's toenails. Hotter than the hinges of I mean. My god. I'm sweating like a sitter in church. I do declare. Hotter than <laughs> socks on a rooster. What? A rooster Millie. Am I rooster? Hey. What's up, buddy? I'm good. How are you? Oh, you know. Hanging in here. This is Dr. Kelly, our newest here. Yep, Dr. Kelly. Welcome aboard. I'm a new hire, too. I, I, if yeah. I was a doctor, it would probably be a conflict of interest, seeing as I'm trying to sell you things. No, I was kidding. Clearly. Not hired hey, I sell time. stuff all the time, real. Real. I sell things all the time, real. I guess anybody who's been hired or fired not no, there's that guy that tried to kill a resident which one I didn't the stab Blake or something the fact that you had to say one is yeah I heard it was great his interviews were entirely wrestling based um uh um, 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 um. Oh, See, that's um, a really good outfit. I'm going to kill you for real. Oh. And, if not, and everyone here can witness me saying that. So you well, all know it's being meditated. Dying? Okay. Uh, no, me, I'm you. dying. Just do Sorry, it. Lobotomize me. Why would I do that? That's the not fourth this. time Lobotomize for a lobotomy Captain. today. She's obsessed with that. Jesus. Them. I like Winston. Lobotomy fetish? To be a doctor if I got lobotomized. Okay, okay. Uh, Marcy, can you come over there, like, towards the vending machines with me and Slim? Millie, you hang out with Mr. Winston, okay? Winston, in okay. charge. Enjoy your time, Millie. Really? No, only I'm in charge. Uh -huh. Awesome. Hello. 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 What's up? Okay. So. Why are you sup? hiding? Yeah, why I, are you hiding? I, well, I was just going over pull to up, the Sloan. vending machines. Did you say pull up? I said circle up. Circle up. Okay. Well, that's better than pull up. Can we do a squat circle? A squat circle? Um, I got terrible D's. It's gonna be no. Ugh, fine. Professional. Okay. Um. So, basically, um, Jeffy, I think you were around the other night. Well, um, the other night when we were talking about some eyeballs, right? Um. Yes. So I a proposal to Derek. Um, Sloan and I have a new business called San Andreas Service, and as part of that. Uh, Sloan has created some really fucking cool tech. If you guys 
want to look at that on your Kihoni. And essentially, we've been given the go-ahead from Derek to do a trial run to see how this goes. So this is really important that this goes well. This is the abridged tech, by the way. I've got a much more comprehensive one. You want to see it? It gets more comprehensive than this. Very. Oh, I, I think that. I'm, yeah, show Jeff. I'm good with the first one. Okay. I got you, Jeff. Hang on a sec. Also, good to meet you. Likewise. We've met. I know, Mercy. I'm not to talking me. to you. Chill. I know. I'm not. I'm not. Hey, we have anyway. Shit. Right, I'll be back. Got it. I'm, I'm coming. Let's go. I'm coming. See, so you can't not talk with a southern accent when. Oh my god, we got a patient. We my got a patient. patient. Anyway, we okay, have. So speaking of patients, run. we have. Yeah, we have a trial run. So today, um, the patient we've got coming in, Larson, right? Max Larson. Like, um,. I'm just confirming that that's his last name, right, Sloan? It's Max Yes, Larson. it is. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. Uh, okay. Jeffy, go ahead and reload that page. All right. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's a little bit more comprehensive. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, Max Larson? Um, yeah. Let me... So essentially, Max lost an eye and then um roman galactic put in one of his synthetic eyeballs into max and it's trying to kill him what's it do sloan knows more about this in his specific situation than i do yeah okay so <laughs> uh roman chats uh evil maniacal person not actually hey. good human being as it turns out he's uh, dead all right I, yeah i, I work with dead. his mother however um so roman uh about the time that uh max was helping mickey to win his first electoral term uh they were in some kind of explosion the way i understand it a helicopter accident or something and he lost his eye and roman's response was to uh i guess try and do an engrafting of some kind of terminator eye is the way that max refers to it and it has an artificial intelligence that fights him there we go. Fights him. Yeah, it's very strange. Uh, and so it's like it's aggressive and talks to him and is it's just the worst. Uh, uh -huh. And and so uh, obviously that needs to be excised. <laughs> and then we're going to engraft with one of these instead. That's right. Gotcha. So, so. Steely, can mm -hmm. into the future. What Formally. would happen? What? What's happening? Ah, she's all by herself now. She's fine. So I do, in the future, the hospital would order in bulk generic synthetic eyes. So they're not customized to the person or to their specific situation. They're for emergency situations. So if it looks like somebody's going to lose their eye. Um, then, you know, you could use these as a temporary replacement. Um, then really they would come back and meet with the doctor surgeon whoever did their surgery and with us and uh they would be fitted for a custom guy so that's what we're doing today with max we're gonna talk to him about um if we could get like a vision test in their eye that'd be fantastic if he wants to match them or have better vision or worse for whatever reason um match eye color like all that stuff so we're it would be great if you know if you wanted to be there jeffy but mercy if you wanted to be there as well I understand that you have millie so no worries yeah, um i won't be here for long either no worries so we'll yeah see. he should be here soon like next 10 minutes perfect okay um and uh we're gonna go through so we actually are gonna be working with the hospital so we'll be the ones manufacturing the eyes and like basically doing his uh client meetings but it would always be great to have the doctor who will be doing the surgery involved um if at all possible um and then so max is a specific a unique case because he is a trial run so we'll be we'll be um fitting his eye obviously specifically like that's what this meeting is for 
Guys, um, there's no surgery or anything today? No, surgery it's today. Just, it's just talking to him and seeing where he wants to go with it? Yes. Gotcha. So that me and Sloan can get the specs together. So Sloan will um, design and then we'll get it uh, manufactured and brought into the city. Um, I have a prototype. Um, so we'll show you kind of what the vibe will look like. Essentially, every single... Uh, Every single eye, we also have skin grips, but it's neither here nor there. Um, if I the mean, eyes go well, we'll be able to... Well, yeah, but It's we the have foundational to get... material to how the eyes work, but sure. I'm just saying, like, for today's relevance, we have to get this eye <laughs> approved yes. before we can even yes. think about skin grips. So, um, I have a type coming, so you can see, but basically the packaging, um, it has It's in the... that uh, second document, if you... Uh, we're able to see that. Um, oh, miss that drop. one. Uh, I'll drop it again. Uh, Mercy, if you wanted to look at the more expansive one, that's there. Okay, okay. But then, uh, yeah, the the doc shows. Um, it's it's actually an overview of the tech in general. You'll want to jump to the eye on the second page, I believe. So basically, every eye comes um, packaged, uh, and they each come with a card. So the card will be linked to that individual. So it has their full name on it, their state ID. It'll have the number for the eye that they have, et cetera, et cetera. So even if the card is stolen, we can get them a replacement. Um, but it is unique to them, and we're going to keep everything tracked back end. Um, but we do have a prototype to show you kind of what that looks like. So hopefully John will be here soon and we can show you. Good old John. He's helping us with the uh, hermetically sealed packaging. Oh, very cool. Sorry. We're really looking at this diagram. This is incredible. Yeah, it's uh, it's it's pretty advanced stuff. What's up, Ash? Uh, uh some here's your guy. There's Mash showing the artificial eye details. Hello, hello. Hi, how's it hello. going? Welcome, sir. Hi. Glad to have nervous, you. But, you know, not bad. Nothing to be nervous about mm -hmm. today. Yeah. This is just a consultation. We'll uh, get the surgery scheduled uh, at this appointment, hopefully. But oh, okay, we do okay. need to fit things up and and get everything sorted. Uh, any chance oh, we yeah. could go do uh, this in an exam room? Perhaps. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's totally. I'll, I'll ask the doctors. Do you, do you uh, want to follow you, up with John? If this is just the, um, if this is just like the consultant thing, Millie could one hundred percent come along with us. Yeah, that'd be dope. Yeah, yeah that's fine. I don't, I don't see. Millie. She's talking so Come loud. help. Hey, Millie. She's very, very loud. She is extremely loud, and I'm just yelling it. Also, if you're yelling, stop yelling in the hospital. You're embarrassing, very Millie. It's so embarrassing for her. Should I call John and see if he's... Yeah, give me a shout. Oh my God, Millie, why were you yelling? I didn't mean to why be. Are yelling? Why didn't were you be being yelling. so loud? I didn't realize it. That was my fault. Millie, where are you from originally? Georgia. Georgia, is that right? What part of Georgia? Like Macon? That was a small town. Smaller than Macon, What's Georgia? It's not that small. It's not that small. <laughs> Peach, Peach sad. You got this. <laughs> See, Mercy, Any same page. Town. Peach Come sad. Uh, I lived on Peach Way Lane. Oh, Tallulah Falls. Tallulah. Tallulah. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Where? 
We're gonna You're coming do with us. a consultation. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Steffi, lead the way. You're Kate. I'm excited. Yes, I am. Uh, I'm just gonna. I told John to call me and I'll meet him in the lobby. Oh, is a turbo? Yeah, it is. Okay, I, I... All right, we'll uh, back here. All right, Millie. So, uh, uh -huh. Mr. Mr. Max here needs a vision test. How are you? How are you with vision tech? Have you ever done anything like that? And, and, and did you know before coming all the way out here? Uh, yeah, I've seen one or two. All right. Let me get right. the poster set up here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can that this one looks more suited. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Max. So. Uh, pop his yeah. glasses off for me. Oh, of course, of course. Yeah, yeah. I should get a look here. See what we're dealing with. All right. Who's that? Who are you? Oh, that was. Okay. Which is it? I'm having a hard time. Oh, it's uh, my right eye, actually. It's uh, so I had Roman Shax give me what he called the Terminator. Eye. Yeah, that's uh, I get, the, a little, get a little bit of that. The Oats is uh, non-functional, so I don't have any of the uh, AI to override my brain anymore. I kept it under a eye patch for long enough, for, at least feel long enough. He said if I keep it dark and don't let it see the world, this, that, or the other, it won't try to my mind. I feel fine. I'm not passive, so. Gotcha. Okay, so is the eye functional? Um, yeah, but I feel like I still get nervous and worry about the the AI partly taking over or it just being dormant. And then you know, one day if a situation arises in which you, maybe my uh, my blood pressure raises high and it reacts to it, and maybe it activates. Uh, I feel more comfortable with uh, Mr. Kelly has proposed. So. These are these are very valid concerns here. Yeah, uh, honestly. <laughs> And I'm gonna be completely honest with you. That is a very terrifying thought to, to have. Yeah, I mean, I work in security, so I with high stress situations all the time. The last thing I need is for one of those to cause a even worse uh, situation happen. Not only do you work in security, you work in security for the mayor who holds a lot of information. I yeah, got, that's actually I got very the true. Poster. All right. Uh, Hi, Mr. Larson. Oh, just what's up, really, honey? Before he does his yeah. test, were you aware um, your uh, not the AI eyeball, the other one. Where yeah. did you have any like short sighted, short sightedness? Were you twenty twenty um, vision? Vision, vision is not terrible, right? It's it's not mm -hmm. not perfect. It's not twenty twenty, but it it's definitely uh, definitely thankful for having the eyes that I have. Okay, awesome. Yeah, I just wanted. So to I see. think yeah, the the having my uh, my eye my my, uh, my AI eye helps mm -hmm. a lot because I have really good vision in it. It's just, it doesn't feel natural. It, it, it right. scares okay. me, so. Awesome. Now that Roman's dead, also really helped the fact that I have this thing in my head. God rest us. Yeah. Yeah? That one. Our, Mr. So Larson. When... Oh, go ahead. Sorry. Oh, no. oh I was going to, I was going to end him to you, Millie, then let you take point okay, on this. If you, you already set up everything. Oh, okay. Got it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that you're introducing me. Oh yeah. Oh, so right, there was talk over radio, and I completely lost track of everything that was happening. All right, this is uh, Millie. Millie Madden. She. This is her first day here. She's doing wonderful oh, so yeah. far. Huh. All right. And oh, that's, uh, that's a great idea. idea. This is Max, by the way. Millie. Max Larson. Max Larson. Yeah. Hi, Max. Um, said one of your eyes is an AI. Or both yeah. Them? My right eye is. Your right eye. Okay, so I do want to see the string of left eye. So if you could just cover up your right eye and then read the uh, first line. All right. Um, the first line from the top. Uh, the top. All right. The first line is A. Okay. Nailed. I'll read the next line. M, J, L, K, Q. Beautiful, beautiful, okay. Read that last line on the bottom. On the very bottom? 
Mm -hmm, the very bottom. Okay. Um. O V A L. Alrighty, alrighty. Okay, uncover your uh, eye and cover up the other one. All right. Alrighty, if you could just break the middle two, starting with the top one. All right. Uh, M J L K Q. Okay. I C U. -K. Jesus, Max. Hey, and I'm just reading the board. So. Whoa. Okay, you got to read that, that last one that, on the bottom. Shame you have to. Is that part of that AI? I really need to just see into. Never mind. Right. Okay, last line. Last line. C V L. Hey, John. Wow. Hey, uh, where can I meet you guys to get you the eye prototypes? We are at Vice Roy, if you want to meet us here. All right, see you soon. Perfect, sounds great. Thank you, sir. The other eye are doing too well. Oh, your normal eye there, Max. Or he is struggling to keep up. I noticed there's an issue. Um, I, I did get one of the ones on the box on the wrong. Yeah, yes. yeah. Even, have you ever had, like, Everybody's issues? Everybody's going to be out, like, uh, like, uh, strength? I'll let you out. Uh, um, sure, if you want to. Honestly, before moving to the city, no, but I think I've been really... Unless you want to meet him, in which case you can. And I can't, just... I can't. Yeah, okay, you yeah, there. stand there. I'm just, just trying to get the read on his, his, see if he wants um, to have, like, a match. You know, you know what to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, um, so would you want to, in, in terms of uh, replace, do you want to, mm -hmm. like, match your vision or do you do you want it do you still want to have one be better than the other is that what you're looking for here um for like i a feel nasty class i cookie think kind of vibe yeah yeah a cookie kind of vibe would be pretty because okay. i just i worry about the that there's an ai I, my my uh, not original eye but if I still have good vision that means for all the the uh the things that have happened to me i i would really have, like you know i would feel like that would be much better to have 100%. I get, I get, I'm picking up what you're down. I'm smelling what you're selling. Oh, yeah. All right. So 2015. Oh, I mean, that works for me. It's a good year. It was a good year. Graduated high school. Is that right? <laughs> year. 2015. Good God. I am so old. Yeah, I know. <laughs> the same way right now. <laughs> All right. Um... <laughs> But yeah, no. Uh, is that all? Is that all really you needed there? Oh, it's just like a. Uh, like, yeah, I mean that's that's a that's a good start. Where, where um, yeah, Max. A, a couple other more more. Um, this is the other problem. Questions. More questions. Are, yeah. Uh, yeah. Are you colorblind at all? Um. No, I I see color. Okay. Perfect. Do you want to? <laughs> Do you want to? No. no I have a chart no, for. Honestly... Wait, I have a chart for that. We could test it. Actually, yeah, let's do that just to make sure okay, okay. Um, okay. that there's not uh, any, any, like, you can be, like, mostly fine and then have some, like, red-green color blindness that you're unaware of. Mm, yeah, yeah, fair enough. Uh, yeah, we just, we're basically, the only reason we're doing these kind of tests, um, the most important thing for you is what we're going to come up with is, is as matching as, as close as possible to your existing structure. Uh, obviously, mm -hmm. if you want heightened vision, we can do that. Uh, if you wanted it exactly the same, we can do that. We can match eye color. Uh, or if you've been a fan of like heterochromia, um, I don't know if you ever saw the X Men movies where Ooh, that, that one chick had one eye color. Badass. Yeah, we can we can do that. Uh, something that I, I would recommend. It's cool for the aesthetic for about twenty minutes, and then you get bored with it and you want to see your own eye color again. Uh, so I'd, I'd say. Maybe don't. <laughs> Maybe just go with your original eye color. Um, but I it is wear glasses a lot though. So. Yeah, uh, and if you're really into that, then you can uh, you can you know wear a contact. Uh, you'll you'll have to do that anyway, right? You'll have to wear one contact if you want to go without yeah. glasses, uh, just because your your prescription is going to be a little different uh, in in the two eyes. Um, mm -hmm. I will also say these eyes. Uh, if you're using just like, I mean, you, let's, let's use the example that we just gave, right? You're covering your left eye, uh, and using just mm -hmm. your right eye, um, which is the synthetic one. Um, mm -hmm. it is going to be strong enough to have completely clear vision. The problem is your eyes work in tandem to give you depth perception. 
Mm -hmm. I see. I see. So, so it, it may be stronger. You may see, may be seeing clearly, but you can't drive with just one eye. Uh, I and, see. and so it's, it's always going to be good to make sure that you're, uh, at least consistently able to see out of both eyes. Uh, the other thing of note, um, while well, Millie, uh, Millie, are you finished? Are you still set? Uh, one, one more. Thing, okay. One uh, well, while she's finishing up, uh, the other thing of note, um, you said that the existing artificial is, um, it, it doesn't feel like your own, right? Yeah, it, 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 so I think it's more at this point, it's grown into me, but it, mm -hmm. it just doesn't feel the same. It's a weird way to describe it. Cause like, I would have never thought that I could, but my eye isn't real. Sure. Until now. Right? <laughs> and now you those, definitely like, know. It's like that ghost phantom people who yeah. are amputees experience mm. i never understood it with this eye but yeah it just feel right especially knowing that could possibly be uh more than just the eye itself having problems so psychologically what does that do for you like does it does that do you hate it do you love it um i don't necessarily hate it but i uh, i do hate the idea that if i ever had a conversational situation that i might uh, react differently than i normally would. sure Okay. I don't. Um, I don't like being the aggressive type. Even though I am in security, I just I feel it uh, makes things worse. I don't yeah. want to be in that situation. So, um, my my biggest concern um, being that I don't want you to just have like one super eye mm -hmm. and your other eye just kind of like going along, keeping up, you know, because that's gonna yeah. that's gonna be a lot of strain like on you, and I don't. Mm -hmm. So you're, what you're suggesting is instead of just doing one eye, doing both? No, 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 no. Oh, I'm, I'm, it's, I think it's certainly what he's trying possible. to say is... Well, we could, yes, but like, you I know, I mean, you got one that works. Is, yeah, what you're what trying to say is that the, the eye that you got to replace, um, your eye, if you will, will probably strain more so because the other eye is doing all the work, so it'll kind of get lazy and, you know... Yeah. The visual oh, lesson God. over time. That's that's what I, that's what I'm concerned with. Um, um, so maybe make sure that the the I'm getting is performing at like same level as my other eye. Close so, enough. Like it, I mean, most or, people. Or oh, you could get laser eye surgery to fix the other. Mm. Uh, I mean, because you're going in surgery already, so you know yeah, you might what as if well I did a dual fix. Operation? Yeah, I'd fix the other one and up. Uh, how well you can see out of that one. That's so a thought. Here, here's here's my concern with that. Um, I would rather it... I'd rather do the replacement first. Okay. And then see how that... See how it reacts. See how it reacts and everything. Headaches, eye starts... Exactly. And then if that happens, then we can talk... Uh, you know, place it. Okay. Yeah. So, so let me talk about the tech a little bit, just so you're aware. Um... Mm -hmm. The prescription that's in there is adjustable after the fact, okay. which is great. Yeah. Uh, that's huge. Holy shit. Right. Yep. Uh, <laughs> well, and that's what you would expect, right? It's, I mean, it's, that's like the one component that is a little modifiable. Um, if most things you would have to do another excision or, or enucleation in this case, but that's not going to be what, what, what happens here. I did want to at least allow for, changes because we know that as people age your vision continues to change and it would be awful if you're you know you're suddenly 75 years old and you've got one giant superpower eye and then the other one is completely failed and uh, like millie was saying here right you can absolutely have um you know lasik uh, if that's something that, that you wanted to do um uh, i think the the suggestion that i would give you is let's let's build uh the initial prescription to what your current is it and and down the line um if you decide that you want to have lasik we'll come back in uh we'll, we can just be mm -hmm. present that same day um change the prescription pretty quickly it's it's not a very difficult thing um i can talk the, yeah. the staff here through it uh and and just make sure that like when you when you wake up uh or come to rather I don't, you're not going to go under for lasik but you know when you come to and, and are more fully aware it will be you know perfect in that in that instance um something also of note where this current eye f doesn't feel like your own mm -hmm. these synthetic eyes will absolutely feel like your own you won't notice a difference in your eye and this one um 
the technology that's used in it is less technology, more bioscience. So it uses uh, what we call our synthetic skin as kind of our, our infrastructure for how we've designed it. And uh, in, in the way in which this works is uh, kind of like similar to a skin graft where the graft will um, fuse to the existing structure of the the cellular makeup of the body. The, the same thing's gonna happen here. Um, as as Jeffy does the uh the the surgery, it'll it'll fuse to your um occipital cord, it'll it'll basically in essence replicate every part of your existing uh structure. Anything that might be missing, it'll replicate. Mm -hmm. and, and it's designed to do this uh by um searching out your DNA structure and then replicating your DNA inside of what this eye has to hold. Um, something that happens a lot of times with transplants, you may have, have seen these happen before or instances where this happened before. Uh, and we, I think Kitty asked about this actually when we had our first conversation. Sometimes when you do organ donors, uh, the body can go into rejection. Um, and that, that happens just because our, our bodies are not designed to uh, have foreign objects in them. Yeah, they um, see they see the new organ as a foreign object and try to kill it. Exactly. Ah, I see. I see. Yep. And and so that that's probably why you experience what you're experiencing now. It your your body doesn't recognize the eye as its own, um, but where it can't kill something that is bionic. Um, yeah. In this case, this would be basically synthetic flesh that it theoretically could. So what we had to design was the ability for it to um, replicate and recognize it as its own. Uh, and so that's what we've done here. Um, so your your body, you won't feel any different. It'll feel like your old eye. Um, you won't notice a difference. Okay. You'll look in the mirror. It'll look like your own eye. Um, literally to the T, you'll wake up from this surgery. And, and I mean, you'll have some pain, some discomfort for a little while. Um, the typical eye surgery is a little bit longer term. Um, I can send you some some details on on the recovery time for it, but we're talking mm -hmm. days versus weeks or months. I mean, it's very quick. Okay. So I, I have a question. Um, yeah. Is this um, actually Ash? Yes, like replication process that you talked about, Sloan. Is mm -hmm. this like something that happens once the eye is laced, or is this like a thing you do beforehand with the eye? Uh, it, like like a like an adjustment period before like the procedure. It's a or good question. Like yeah. So, so typically, um, what we have done in the past, uh, before bringing it to the city, we had to take a biopsy, uh, and, and we, uh, as we were finalizing the structure of, of the eyes, we would basically infuse the DNA in, into the, uh, the, whatever we were working with, right. Whether it was, uh, the, the grafts or the eyes or any kind of musculature or anything like that. Um, the problem we found was emergency situations. It was much harder to get, um, something in place quickly. So I reformulated it so that this actually happens in real time. Um, you'll see Jeffy on that documentation that I sent you. It happens as soon as you make that first splice, uh, as, as soon as you connect whatever, and, and you may have to, uh, like cut off a little bit of the, the occipital cord from um, the the eye that we'll give you. It may be too long, it may be too short, whatever. Uh, well, I don't. It wouldn't be too short. It may be too long. <laughs> you'll you'll have to cut it to length to make sure it's not too too long. If it's too short. We're gonna send it back. Right. If it's too short, we'll have to do another. <laughs> we give you extra. Yeah. Well, no. no you okay. extra cordage. We give you extra cordage. It's, it's not, there's no extension cables for no, I, I, human I meant technology. It's, it's got. It's connected yeah, no, already. It, it is. Okay. Yes. Uh, it is absolutely. It's too long on purpose. Right. It's too long on purpose. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, and um, you get Don't, again hanging out of the socket pool. Yeah. That, <laughs> I, I, would, yeah I would appreciate. It. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, before we got we it in there, but farther, damn, I'll be damned if he just can't. I don't know what's wrong with. It. Well, he can. It just doesn't cover his eyeball. <laughs> yeah, it blinks behind his eye. It's like putting a door over an extension cord. <laughs> you can do oh, it. Go it's ahead, just... do this. this uh, color <laughs> test. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead and do that. I'll pick up in a second. Your rod eye, and then start at the top line. All right. So the top line 
Oh, do you want me to read the letter or just the color? Uh, let's do both for fancy. All right. I see red J, blue A, purple L, pink E, then yellow L, green U, blue M, pink Q, then R, purple V, red G, and yellow E. Okay, you can uncover uh, in the other eye. All right. All right, same thing. Start at the top. Red J, blue A, purple O, pink E, yellow O, green U, blue M, pink Q, orange R, purple V, red G, and yellow E. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Yeah, you're you're good. You're good. Hold on on that one. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. All right. Where were we? Uh, the science. Um, I don't know if it's interesting yes. or not. I can... oh, I'm incredibly interested in this. <laughs> <laughs> true, true. At, at I the, mean, yeah. Max. Though, unless Max is interested, I don't know that we need to take up yeah. more of his time. Yeah, Max. Oh is, no, I mean, I love um, hearing about this because it's going in my head. So. That's <laughs> right. Okay. Um, well, I just want okay. to assure that you're you're comfortable with it. But yeah, the, oh, no, the idea uh, again. Ultimately, when when Jeffy's doing the the surgery, the optic nerve that he's going to be replacing or. or, or um, Ultimately, it's going to graft to your existing nerve endings. That's what's happening now uh, with the AI that's there. He'll have to enucleate that that eye and then uh, graft this new one in. And as soon as that happens, and I can, again, I've got documentation I can send you on this if you're really interested in it, uh, it will start to synthesize your DNA throughout the eye. Um, like I said, it does take a couple days to, to fully heal and to graft fully. So you definitely don't want to get shot. You don't want to get hit in the eye. You want to take it easy. Oh, um, but, but, uh, the recovery process is insanely fast, uh, compared to, um, what a typical recovery would be for something like a corneal transplant. Okay. Hell yeah. Um, I also, I just spoke to John outside and got the prototypes. Um, oh, what happened with... Um, so they're part of this max that you'll be given after surgery as part of your outpatient, um, it's a mm -hmm. registration card. So it'll have your name, your state ID, and it'll also have, um, all of your like specific, um, like for the, uh, along with that, um, the, the product code, like that, um, of the eye itself. Oh, so um, if it gets stolen from you, we can't place it. Um, but it does have your information on it. Um, and Jeffy, you'll see, so Jeffy, I'm going to give you the box. Um, okay. I was going to ask, would that card need to be presented to obviously change his prescription or like anything like that? Or like, yes, that yeah. way you can put the ID number. Oh, um, right. so oh, Jeffy, that's what, the, that's what the box looks like. Um, there's not an actual eye there right now. It's just a prototype. Yeah, a um, but if you box. use that, you'll be able to see, like what the card looks like. Okay. And Max, that's for you. That's the card. It's just got my information on it, just as a example. Okay. But okay. So do you want real... to use the box? Oh, I use see. It. I see. It's pretty okay. cool. Okay. So Jeff, you'll see the box. There's obviously the prototype eye. It's not. It's just like a ping pong ball. Yes. Um, but oh, then you'll also shit. see the card, and that's what you'll be giving to Max. Yeah, um, and it'll have his information. It'll also have his information and serial listed on the outside of the box as well. Um, so the box I just gave you is the generic type. Um, so whenever you were doing emergency, and you can keep that, uh, okay. whenever you were doing an emergency surgery, um, when you would open the, it would have a generic card it would just have the serial code on it. Um, and you give that to them and that way they can come back to us and with us and we can get them, you know, a custom eye like fitted for them. Engage it and everything. Okay. Exactly. All right. So you get oh. one of those cards, registration cards, either it'll just either be generic just with the serial code or it'll have their name information listed on it. Boxes do look slightly different for generic and for specific. Gotcha. Yes, yeah. now the only thing we need to do is schedule a time. Mm -hmm. Knock this out. Give us okay. at least, I would give us at least um, until Tuesday. Uh, Bond doesn't work the weekends, so um, for My dog to get everything sent to and Sloan to work on the specifications, give us mm -hmm. the weekend. 
and then give us a 48 hour period to get everything over to, to John. So like, like Wednesday at the soonest. Uh, Thursday or Fridays work really well for me right now. And then um, after next moving forward, it'll be like Sunday, Monday. So whatever you guys want to do. Um, even like even around in the afternoon works as well. Okay. Uh, do you want to shoot Thursday then? Yeah, it works just fine. Oh, yeah. With the same deal, Max? Um, yeah, if, if we're if we're doing it on Thursday, the same time will work for me. Jeffy, so, can you do that on Thursday? A five on Thursday? Yeah, like right now on Thursday. Yeah, I could do oh, that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm yeah. looking forward to it. Yeah. Sweet. I may uh, I may see if I can have someone join me. Yeah. Of, unless you don't want anything. I would have someone there with me. It, it'll probably be a good, a good idea. Um, Jeff, yeah, I'll provide you. There's just a couple things. Uh, you've got the documentation pieces already. There's a... Um, mm -hmm. There's a couple other things I want to send over. <laughs> yeah, a couple other <laughs> things I want to send over, uh, like a video that, that'll kind of gotcha. give some more further explanation for you. But um, otherwise, uh, I mean, you've done plenty of the enucleations before. It's basically the reverse of that. Yeah, gotcha. I can, I can do it. I'm sure it won't be that difficult. No, yeah, no. Nah. I've done, I've done worse. Yeah, it's, it's more just the uh, ensuring that the... Uh, the nerve endings attach appropriately and they should right They're they're designed to just mm -hmm. pick up as soon as they they um fuse so uh yeah i'm excited so is that gonna be a weird be a weird thing for me like i go to put it in and it's just gonna kind of no 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 it's not, it's not I, know, you know, I didn't know if i was gonna no, like go to nothing, like set it in it's gonna no, like, no, nothing, like snatch to it or something nothing weird, like sci-fi okay. no no no, no. Okay, it's, cool. it's not like cool, that cool good because i'd freak out no i mean it'll seem like a human eyeball Right, exactly. For all intents and purposes, it will be exactly like everything you have removed from people. Uh, Do you guys think that eyeballs are squishy? Do you think they're what? Squishy? You ever held an eyeball? Squishy. No, I've never held an eyeball. You didn't have to do that when you went to med school? No. We never held a human eyeball? No. Where did you they're go to firm. med school? They're firm. It's like firm? a grape. I don't grape. That's that's a good to say it. Yeah. I'm slightly disappointed that they're not squishy. Stress ball. I mean, you can poke your eyeball, and like I wouldn't recommend it, but you can touch that. your own eyeball. I mean, if you've ever put in contacts, you kind of touch your own eyeball. It's not squishy. It's not like a stress. Ball. Yeah, I wouldn't imagine you would have to hold a human eyeball oh, in school. Uh, it doesn't seem like eyeball. standard practice unless you're into optometry. Yeah. I've taken Surgic. a mini eye out, but I do yes, have that surgery. Sense thing here. Things are a little bit different, maybe. God, yeah. That's the fair. That I operated in. So. That is fair since living here. I've taken a mini eye out. Um, it is mini yeah. today, so of course she hasn't had to get down and dirty wearing socks look at her socks stay on she's very proud of her socks oh yeah socks stay on i was bullied no nope, my not, choice you, you put no no socks no on, tweeted i was about bullied them, so. about my shoe choice and she. i changed I changed i changed them and then i bullied again so i wore the socks so i wouldn't get bullied okay okay anyway um Max, thank you so much for having to meet with us. And then we'll yeah, see you on Thursday. Any questions before then? Hello, can I yeah. help and you? And I'll let you guys, if there's any scheduling errors or anything like that yeah, at the time as well. What Max, are those? My num I think I have your number though, Max. Like, my, for my certain, signals? actually. Yeah. Yeah. It should end at 788. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Yeah. 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 Awesome. All right. Hell okay, yeah. yeah. Let's, let's come back out to the lobby. I don't, All I think right. the door's locked with me here and there, but. After you, thank you. Yeah, me too. I, uh, yeah, I'm excited to get this thing out of my head. I've been covering it up like for months now, and it, it feels good to be uh, knowing that I'll be like free of it. For sure. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. Thank you for the test today, Millie. You're doing great. I appreciate your help today. Oh, my God. Thank you. Oh, yeah. I heard you guys well. Oh, I can thanks. observe.
Hey, yeah, crossed. Oh, yeah. no. I mean, who hey, wants to be in there? I would. I wouldn't mind if you were. No. Yeah. Uh, Sloan Bunny, it was a pleasure seeing you as always. Yeah, absolutely, man. I'm yeah, excited absolutely. for being right. the first patient. Well, will, patient zero. Yeah, we'll yeah, check up. We'll have a check up with it. you after surgery, just to make sure everything's going well. I appreciate it too. Yeah. Area how everything's like taking work too <laughs> i'm hype yeah. on this i'm very excited about this thank you guys for the opportunity yeah of I course doing stuff like this i i don't think i've ever been first in the city for anything so this will be pretty cool yeah it's happenstance being in the city uh and i guess working for mickey that uh, yeah it's always the, the, the worst circumstances sometimes that <laughs> right. do the best thing right absolutely so this is this is good stuff oh, yeah. man I'm, I'm pumped yeah me too Oh yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna get back to work, um, hey, and I'll also put in a vacation request for them. That way, they know I'm not going to work for those few days afterwards, too. Perfect. All right. Yeah. I mean, that should that should give you the weekend to recover. You you shouldn't need. Oh, I mean, by Monday, you should be close to 100. percent Just tip top. Perfect. You got to yeah. say you need more time if you need a little vacation, though. Time. You got you got <laughs> PTO days. Uh, it's gonna be kind of hard swinging that. I just got back vacation, so I don't know if Penny will be too happy if I take too many days off. But medical leave, it makes sense. Yeah, you got it. Get your doctor's note. I got you. Hell yeah! Thank you, thank you. Hell yeah, buddy. All right. Well, you guys take care, and I'll see you, you guys too. soon. Yeah, man. Yeah, see good. you soon. Bye. Bye. So nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Don't get the other like out. Oh my god. If he does, then we can up his yeah, prescription. Make him too. Fine, right? yeah. Okay, so look at this. Uh, don't open it. Don't open it. Check that shit out. That's what he was talking about. Oh, my hell yeah. Isn't that cool? That's super cool. I can't wait. Hi. Hi Five Mercy. Eastern Thursday. Oh, here you go. You can have that one. In his head. Oh, okay, thanks. Today? Five Eastern next Thursday. That's just the standard. Oh, okay. If you want a card mm -hmm. too, I can give you so you have a before and after. Oh, even no, that's okay. On that one. Ooh, today's Friday. Okay. It's Friday. It is it's Friday. Friday. Hey, Anybody need any food? That means wrestling. I'm no. doing great. No, no. Do you need food? I'm actually good. I have a bunch of food. I was just wondering if you were going to go get some and just have like, there's like so much pizza we have, right here. We have pizza here, yeah. Sheesh, okay. You want some pizza? Nah, I, got, I got some sandwiches. Ellie, I'm stealing you. Oh. Oh. Stole Bye, oh. Millie. Bye. Lovely to see you all. Bye. Bye. Love to see you. Bye. She's a heart. Bye. Bye. Yeah. Uh, thank you guys for the opportunity. Yeah. Guys. I'm excited. For You're sure. the one who said, yes, I would do it. <laughs> yeah, I did. So really, <laughs> your own opportunity. Don't thank us. For real. It. <laughs> this is my stuff. I love shit like this. Hell yeah. Uh, is there anything else I would give him? Uh, not that I have prepared today. Um, okay. I figure we can get an outpatient. I can send it to him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was just giving my phone number. Um, yeah. Uh, definitely need your email. Um, I am working, oh, like I said, on yeah, working on some um, video materials. That will be helpful for anybody uh, just to kind of explain a little bit more detail and ignore that. Dope. Thank you. Professionalism at its finest. Me saying dope at the end of a meeting. Dope. Sayonara. <laughs> All right, I'm setting the interns home. I'm pretty sure, pretty sure I said I'm hype as fuck about this. I don't think that's sure very did. professional <laughs> either, but I'm excited. <laughs> This is so dope. I'm hype as F. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah, are you over here judging me, Mercy? Am I judging? I feel awfully judged. Is that is that what you're asking? That's exactly what I asked. Yeah. Okay, I guess I'm here to Okay. Alright, do you feel judged? Why are you standing so wide? It's fucking wide life. You wouldn't get it. She stays You're wide. Exactly right. I would not get you it. You wouldn't fucking get it. Wait till he sees me with cannoli. Most wide people I've ever seen. Ever. No thanks. Funny thing, we are independently. We were wide before we knew each other. You tried to connect me to being wide. I couldn't do it. 
Yeah, he's not got it on him. I don't have it in me to be wide. Yeah, so you sent the interns home? You tossed them? Yeah, yeah, I'm really tired. And I've been with them for a while, so Jeremy is going to be here in like an hour and a half. They can take a break. Gosh. I wish I had access to the uh, intern channel. That way I could see if they're going to be around. Why would you need that? I like working Nosey with the interns. You'll get there one day. No, I know. You're putting in hours and having a good attitude. Um, yeah, I think the only thing other than Sloan's like training channel is I'd like to create like an outpatient like pamphlet that we give to him. That's like, if you have any concern, if X, Y, Z thing happens, like, you can call or come back and, um, and to give him a general idea of recovery time. Yeah. I have all the recovery times mapped. Um, which okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I just would just need to put, put it in something, in... something that looks yeah. pretty. That's right. You Percy, if you're available, pretty. do you want to jam with me? When? Thursday, next day, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard. Let like me now check my schedule on my phone. And you can, you're just there to lend a hand out. I'm gonna, thank Damn. you, because Millie got it wrong earlier. I might be able to be there. I'll let you know. Just Not remind sure. me beforehand. Actually, wait, a lot. Oh, Is it a Coca-Cola we'll day? It's that's exactly when Coca Cola ends. So I might, uh, I might be a couple minutes late, but we'll see. What time? Five Eastern. Right now. No, I lied. Like no, time. I lied. I right off, now. I, I got Coca Cola Thursday. until six Eastern. That's okay. Boo. Boo. What did he say? She just was silent. Oh, well, that's not getting it wrong. It is her No, I like for the. Oh, oh I thought you Shania meant Twain thing. And then, so, then she thought it was the same person who sang strawberry wine. Yeah, the Dixie Chicks. No. no. <laughs> God, I want to stab everyone today. I do love the Dixie Chicks, though. Oh, Fuck me up was ready to make nice. Ah, oh, my good man. How you oh, doing? Oh, shit. What do you want? Soon to be mayor. What's everybody doing? Uh-huh. Soon to be mayor. Have you guys seen my website? I have. No. It doesn't have enough porn. It's, up, it's updated. There is now mail on it. All right. What? Yeah, just go yeah, to votecuban.army. Got... Mm -hmm. I just went to it. It's really good. Do you make the mayonnaise yourself? Yeah, it's, it's homemade. You just go yeah, I'm going to release it to the public soon. This is fantastic. That must be a lot of good work. I fucking love this. Like pink sauce. sauce. <laughs> oh. No, it's mayonnaise. What do you mean? It's going to be part of my mayoral campaign, like promotion. I'm going to give out free mayonnaise to anybody. Mayo roll. I get it. Yeah, you see. That's I'm sorry, funny. where am I going to look at this? Ah, vote the Cuban army. That was beautiful. Right? Isn't it great? Yeah. Love wow. This. I love this website. <laughs> What's up, pork? Okay, why does that sound sarcastic? I'm just admiring it. It's not sarcastic at all. I love so it. Good. You're gonna vote it's got for me, right? Beautiful eyes. I don't know. It depends on who's running. It's me, Mayor Mickey, or the attendant. Uh, he can vote. He can. He can run again. I thought there's a he's, term limit. He's gonna try to be. fuck. He's. He's. So what someone told me is that he's trying to uh, change the legislation so he could run a third term. It's already been he submitted. Be a forever mayor. Yeah, so. So this is an. An election, you know? It, we need to show him that we don't like you. You can't sit with us. Wait, what? You don't to like Mickey. me? Oh, I know, I'm saying to Mickey. Mickey. We need to oh, show exactly. him exactly. we don't like so, you. Mickey. Yeah, exactly. And then you vote me, and then he gets out. Yeah. And then boom. My understanding that the scope of that legislation said he needed to have a super majority or some kind of over majority or something, so... I think what's going to be really interesting to me is if uh, if he wins but not by enough, and then whoever wins by second is going to like like you won, but only as a consolation prize. Well, I'm so far I've gotten a lot of people. I mean, just if they tell me, it doesn't really make mean anything. But it it appears like I have a lot of from the city, so that's pretty good. That's good, man. Oh, see, 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 see. 
Heck yeah. And then when you're in office, you can hire SAS to assist with things. That's Bunny and Mai's company. Oh, I'll be first lady. Wait, what do you mean? What do you, what, what, what do you mean? I'm gonna leave you alone. Bunny. What assistant do you... What, oh, what bye. Are you I'm trying to talk to them. I don't think I want to talk to you. Are you... Oh, we were having yeah. a conversation. Oh, wow. Nobody wants to I talk to you. To He's too. my campaign That's manager. Oh, okay. What were you uh, saying? The, you the company. Yeah, well, I just. That's what our company does is political consulting. Like, that's what I was doing for Mickey, writing all the legislation. Oh, that got oh passed. yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. I was just looking for your number the other day on my phone. Literally, we've had this conversation like four times as well, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't, I don't like have your number, I think. You do. I texted it to you. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a uh, uh, What's your name again? Sloan Kelly. He's probably said that eight times, too. No, I don't have your number. I didn't save it. Okay, but look in your text messages and type in Sloan. Um, it no, it's, it's not, it's just not there. Ah. <laughs> okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Boom. See? Okay, perfect. Okay, okay, now I have. Save it. I don't know why I didn't save it last. I was lit thinking about you, I think, yesterday before, and I wanted to talk to you, and then I couldn't find it, and I forgot you texted me, and I was like, well, I'll bump into him eventually. And here we and here are. Here we are. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. How much? Uh, how much do you guys? Well, that's the thing. If if you hire us once you're in office, you just pay us from the state account. Well, yeah, yeah, but still, how much is it? Much uh, is it kind of ranges based on how many people we have employed. Uh, and also what you want. Yeah. Like how much you want from? Yeah, <laughs> depends on the services. Uh, what Mickey was doing. The average monthly was like 1.2 or 1.3 uh, because there were like four of us working for him. Uh, we're a little bit smaller than that now. There's only like two of us. Uh huh. But I was also writing all his legislation and basically being his number one guy. That's that's what I'm looking. I'm looking for like legislation because I know how to say the things that I want, but I, mm -hmm. I probably wouldn't know how to write it in the language it needs to be in. I got you, man. If that makes sense. Just I can do English. <laughs> but yeah. But the, we should set up like future. a meeting. We <laughs> should set up a meeting or something whenever yeah. you guys are busy. That way we could talk more shit out, you know? Absolutely. Yeah, anytime. Uh, Bunny's usually around about this time, and I can definitely stick around a little bit longer. I'm usually she in the earlier store. But... Putting a fucking helmet on. What? Me? Oh, do I need a helmet? Oh, hey, Steve. You you needed that helmet. You and I both know that you did that helmet. No, I didn't need that helmet. You did. You did. You know, did need that helmet. Our, our relationship has been a roller coaster. Okay, good. First, good, I good. didn't like you. Then I liked you. Then you shoved him in my head, and then I didn't like you again. I thought that you looked great in that, by the way. I and also, it, for your own benefit, I was doing it because I care about you. Your head, how is it? Sure. I mean, it's fine. What did if... you do with my helmet? Did you throw it away? No, I'm not. Yeah, you, yeah. Oh. The truth of the lie. The truth. Do you throw it in the trash? What'd you do with that? Fill it up with water and the sink it in the ocean? The minute I walked out of here, I just flung it off my head. The minute you walked out of here, you couldn't even yeah. keep it on longer than a minute. No, I look like it. Did you get hit in the head since then? Nope. No? No. Are you sure? What do you mean? I do with a hammer all the time. No, recently. Ooh, really not since fun. I do. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Oh. Okay. I mean, I, I don't know how to. I, was, I wanted like a metal plate with lasers and shit, and they put some plastic shit in there. We give okay. you metal plates with lasers. Yeah, not other people. I mean, if you went into my brain, you could have like given me a special power. Besides my dashing good looks. I think looks. you have to do a bat of acid for that. Steve, mm -hmm. what do you. All you do is collect clues. Oh. Here, I found this. What? This is yours. She went to college a long time ago. Yeah, she found it out. There you go. There you go. That's for Josh you. now. You've seen it. The blur. Steve, right? The, the, Wait, the it's move. Josh now. Who is it now? No, his name changed. I know. No, Josh is right. Was it Josh? No, 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 no because the... it was oh. Steve, then Josh, now it's somebody else. No, I thought it was Steve. 
somebody else and then Josh. Yeah, Peter. it was Steve, somebody else, and Josh. Oh, Paul, yeah, Simon, yeah, yeah. Garfunkel. Stop it. Garfunkel and Garfunkel? Fuck yeah. What Peter, the Paul, fuck and is Mary. happening here? I'm just naming random bands from a long time ago that probably most people in the circle won't get. It's fine. I'm old. Beach Bonnie. See, that was Beach Bonnie. Did, did you just call it a bitch? No, Beach Bonnie. That's not very nice. I've had good first. What? I didn't know. Bon <laughs> you never and Beach Bonnie. <laughs> oh, the Beach Boys. It was Steve, Joe, and now it's Josh. Yeah, Joe, Joe that was, was the metal hell. guy. There it is. Oh, what Joe, the drug about? addict. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. About the well, they, no, they claimed everybody was the drug. They said Steve died from overdose. Uh, you want oh, doctors right, or right. DOC? Look Steve right there. She just doesn't have the outfit Joe on. Joe has made... I would assume that if he was, no, like, fired or let okay. go for being a drug addict, that he would not be on the most recent season of yeah, Blue's yeah, yeah. which he is we'll on the most recent season. No, uh, all just the same old shit that the people... Like, you There's know, Marilyn like Manson, Rams you know. sucking his dick, all that shit. They also Blue's said he was in, a, like, a hot or... band or some shit. Yeah, Steve's right there. Just ask Steve. I think Steve, Steve was in a band. That's what they say. I, I don't know if you the mamas was. and the papas. Steve, were you in a band? I mean, uh, didn't you no. guys see the reunion that they did for him? Well, I'm, I'm 62 years old. No, I, I definitely did not see that. They did like a, I think it was earlier this year or last year. They did a thing where they reunited Steve. Who was it? Yeah. Joe. Are you talking about? Are you talking about the the, about the, the, the tear trigger that was going around yeah. on? Yeah. yeah. Right, he no, made no, a no, little no, video. He came too. back from college. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's like, cry. I hate that video. He's like, you all blew up all that shit. Yeah, and then they yeah. did like a special. They did like an episode. It was like a special, and all three of them were there. <laughs> and Blue looks weird now, and the other oh, movie, Blue's yeah. looked weird. Wow. She's she's, she's three dimensional. Looks... Yeah. Really? yeah, I hate the three dimensional shit. It's kind of creepy. And some of them it. aren't, and then some of them are three dimensional. It's really weird. I don't know. I don't oh, know. I like the, the new theme songs. The new All I had song. growing up was the yeah, the new it's Clues and You theme song. I don't know about that. It's Clues, Clues, and You. So good. I know it's that Bear in the Big Blue House is on Disney Plus. I remember that. So that's all I really is care it, about. I thought it was this week. Is it, I thought it, it, today? I it come out today. It come out today. May I thought it was in theme. Oh, I'm wrong then. Oh, the no, no, I thought the movie came out today. That oh yeah, yeah, I'm watching that. Yeah, yeah, same. Okay. All, All right. right, I'm getting out of here. If you go off duty, three one one, please. All uh, right, bye. Yeah, I'm gonna behind you. I'm gonna three one. I'll send it three one. Wait, so slow. So, yes, sir. So what do you guys do? Basti. What do we do? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I don't think I. Don't uh, know what I'm doing. so for okay, Mickey what specifically, what I was I managing was uh, basically people wrangling in large part, uh, finding the right folks who could help basically do anything he wanted to do, whether it was contract negotiation, getting the right lawyers in place, uh, create, I, I was drafting up legislation for him on his behalf, uh, getting things submitted to the Senate. Um, we were doing a bunch of financial stuff because the office of the mayor has a lot of re financial responsibilities. Uh, so I have a, um, also, CFO that works for me. This, how did I get this sword on my back? I don't know, but it looks dope, man. What I fired you? And I got a chain. Uh, he didn't fire me. I quit. Um, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, he, he, uh, so I started working back? for the FIB, um, doing some consultative <laughs> stuff for them. Why do I got a chain? Uh, a knife? I mean, a sword? It looks like, it looks like a lot this. of stuff going on. Hold on. But, uh, yeah, so I got <laughs> pulled into a meeting. Oh my god, um, there's a paw print. The Jesus, I'm having a hard time. Let's walk over here. Uh, Anyway, I got pulled into a meeting with uh, Mickey and Cerberus and the FIB where they were questioning what my business was doing. And Mickey uh, basically called out that I was trying to, in his words, usurp the throne, even though literally a private organization can't do that. Uh, what we were doing was literally everything he asked us to. He just didn't like it. Um, and so I resigned. Um, because he had ended up giving a bunch of my business information to Cerberus, uh, which I thought was extremely illegal 
and I didn't want to be associated with somebody who I thought was going to get impeached uh, or sued or whatever. Um, so that was kind of my end of term, end of service with him. Uh, and so I've just been consulting on the side with people who've needed assistance in the meantime. Do you, uh, have you talked to any, uh, about that? Oh yeah. Plenty. Hmm. That might be uh, good for me, you know? Oh, of course. Yeah. I'm suing Mickey. He currently owes me $1.4 million. Uh, Holy shit. Yeah. Uh, for services rendered and out of pocket fees. Uh, and because he's being petty, doesn't want to pay me. So he's going to get, uh, He's gonna get served with paperwork any day. Holy shit. Yeah. Okay. Um I'm probably not I'm probably gonna want you guys to work with me. Alright. Because uh what I so I'm trying to build like a team, like an actual team. Mm -hmm. Um Preacher's my campaign manager, he's also gonna be a deputy mayor. Okay. He's gonna be working closer like um like businesses and stuff like that to get them approved and things like that. Sweet. Or and I have to be in most of those conversations because sure. I don't really want to deny people what they want, but mm -hmm. sometimes they gotta be a little no, better. You, if you, not. Yeah, yeah, you can't just accept everything. Yeah, uh, yeah, but I yeah. don't want to say no. I want to sit there and maybe like oh, that's the idea. help make it better. You know? Yeah, you sit with them and tell them what's wrong with it. You don't just deny. It. Well, that's, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's been kind of the issue with how yeah. things oh. have gone at the last part of this term well really most of this term is there's been no explanation there's um, been nothing really right uh i i was also working on a lot of the economics of this last term uh before i stopped working with him like the why the city is the way that it is like civilians don't make any money <laughs> uh, well, i mean that's kind of off why right but there's a fix to it and mickey just never wanted to implement any of those oh, things there's plenty fixes yeah i agree right uh, and so I had put together a bunch of proposals on how to start solving those problems uh, and various programs that would help. Uh, he just didn't want to listen to it. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I would gladly. I mean, whatever you need, man, uh, especially helping you guys get off the ground quickly. That's always like the, the hardest part of any new term coming in is like learning the ropes out of the gate. That's part of the reason I hired Bunny as a former mayor. To like actually yeah. help people get equipped in the first like week rather than waiting a month. Okay. So. Yeah. When your term's already almost over in a month. Right. Exactly. Well, that was literally something she and I talked about when I first moved to the city was she, she waited too long uh, to start doing things and asked for a lot of permission. And what we've seen out of Mickey's term is you don't really have to ask for permission. You can just kind of make decisions depending on what decisions they are. Um, certainly things like what you do with the state budget, uh, as long as it's well documented and not illegal, um, you can, you're can you allowed to spend that money. Um, I mean, to be fair, Bunny got fucked. Bunny did. She got absolutely ran. She just, she just was mayor at the very wrong time. The worst possible Very time. wrong time, yeah. What happened? The storefront. Bunny was the mayor right before the, yeah, you know, they, she pushed the fronts are going to be the best thing ever. And everybody knew it was going to go to and it, it went to hell real quickly. Yeah, they closed the the markets in, in Dean's World, and so a bunch of businesses got screwed. Uh, then only certain businesses were the storefront, and then on top of it, it they had they like 200, 300,000 to get one, and it was like, what the? F we don't even work. Yeah. How are we going to get that? So, yeah. Sloan, I got a question. Sure. Do you think there's any way of getting the farmer's market for Dean's World back open? No. Still no. having um, the storefronts no. open? I've told you what. I'll email you about no, that. No, yeah, you have to email because yeah, I, that's I, that's I, like a it's an economic issue. Because the way I have because because I feel like there's too many stores now, Sloan, mm -hmm. and like people don't even know what the fuck they are. So yeah, but it would be that's... better to open it open like both of them to have the starting point, and then once you start getting better at your business, then like I, like the go sees like oh we're doing good at the fuck or whatever, then you could get the store from kind of like a. Mm opening these if that uh, makes yeah, sense. I see what you're saying kind of like a this is your proving ground until you eventually just how it should have been it, yeah, yeah absolutely the, it should be the what's up Rose? comes in that was the reason it got, got rid of it was because of the production of product yeah I don't know how to explain it 
Yeah, well, I mean, the, email it to me if anything. Yeah, yeah, I'll the, email. I mean, the what John does, John Miller and the factory, what they do now, and uh, especially like food production and and all of the the nature of how that side of the economy works. It, I mean, it's it it is that part isn't broken. Um, what's broken is a combination of things. One that people choose to be isolated in their small groups. Um, yep. Another thing is our system by which getting a train ticket can be purchased. Mm -hmm. uh, and so you have a lot of people who are purchasing train tickets to not come in yes. to the city. Uh, and, and so like, those aren't things that you can necessarily fix as the mayor. You can have some of those conversations with the city planners and, and the, the economic developers and, and, you know, see what they would say about it. But the truth is it's not up to you. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, I'm, it's not up to me. I just meant like to have the conversation, you know. Yeah, it, it, it never hurts to to. Sure. Like, you know I'm gonna I mean? be real with you. The only reason I want to be the mayor is I'm really fucking tired of seeing only the same faces yep. be successful in this fucking city. I'm so fucking up. Yeah, I, I helped somebody submit a business proposal. I, so, like, I've been in the midterm. I've been consulting on business proposals because I kind of know what the mayor's office wants to see. Uh, and so I've been drafting up a bunch of them and, and submitting them. And, uh, what I have seen is if people like you, they'll accept it. Yep. And, and if yeah. they don't, they won't. I re and, quit both Dodo and Burger Shop for the same reason. I've been working at Dodo, making them graph designs, helping at the interviews. I've been there for, I can't even count how long. And people that I have interviewed last week are already managed. I'm just over it. Yeah. There's, there's definitely a lot of brokenness and, um, what's the right term? Uh, nepotism. Yeah. This is the boys and girls club. Doesn't mean that we have to be the boys and girls. Club. No, that's the exact point we're yeah, trying yeah, to say. Yeah. I mean, that doesn't mean that if we don't know them and they give us something, if it's shit, it's shit. No, it yeah, shouldn't be sure. no one, no one said anything. Oh, the way okay, Bunny okay. did no, it. No, no, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna tell you right. this way. I've had business approved through. Who was the one that was just approving a shit ton of business? That was Emma. No okay, okay. Bunny would act down with you and do an actual meet. Okay, yeah, that's. And the, then I feel like I just want to be Bunny. It's kind of back to it's it's back to Emma style, but just not as much. It's just basically you call and they're like, approved. No, it's denied. That's it. Yeah, but yeah then, we tried but... to meet with everybody. So, like, because you have an option on the application, too, if you want to meet in person, so people get pity. I don't want to, like, get people out of having a business if they just get just doing, like, you know, eating. But well, I, I thought that we kept it pretty casual. Like, no, you I, know. Well, I think so, too. Um, But, yeah, just you know, the people who actually want to meet in person and tell you about business and you get a better sense of, like, what they're going to do, especially if it's not coming across on paper. It's just much faster to give them feedback that way if they need to some revisions. Um, but yeah. Um, listen, I've got to run. Sloan, do you okay. need me to give you a ride somewhere? No, no, I'll, I'll be all right. Thank you. Okay, you guys be okay. safe and have a great day. Okay. Dude, it's nice meeting you, Booney. Hopefully, yeah. we work more. Okay, together. Yeah, I'd love to like hear about your platform and everything more in depth. Um, yeah, I just got yeah. right now, but soon, soon, soon. Okay. All right. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Good. Be safe, guys. Have a great Bye. day. Bye, Bye Bunny. Yeah. So, do you want to be part of my team? Uh, you don't want to be part of the team. Wants to get Why not? Work. I mean, he, he's work. gonna he's gonna end up working. <laughs> uh, if I become mayor, I'm gonna fucking hire him. Like, yeah, I'm gonna need someone to help me out anyway. I if I come become part of your team, I have to do so silently because of what I yeah. do. Uh, yeah, no, I have no, to be no, impartial. I, I know. But yeah, I mean, if you need, I'll, I'll say it this way: if you need help or want help. My door's always open. I'm happy okay, to help. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's good. That's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but, um, I'll, uh, I'll text you my email so you can hit me up. Okay. okay. Um, yeah, we should uh, set up a meeting between me, Bunny, and, and Preacher. Yeah. And uh, talk more stuff out, you know? But, um, you said <laughs> around this time? Yeah, Bunny. Bunny's schedule is a weird one. She come, kind of comes and goes in the city a little bit. So, so like one PST, uh, three o'clock Eastern time. Uh, yeah, I always see her kind of like early in the mid, day. mid 
No, mid NA storm into kind of AU storm is always what I see around. Yeah, that's and, and she like fluctuates. She may come in for a yeah. little while, then she'll leave and then come back again. Okay. Okay. But she's usually boys at least here. Five. Okay. I don't, and... I don't think she's ever gone a long period where she wasn't around. I mean, you do a meeting later today if we're all not busy. Everybody's doing shit now. They just left. No, but right now, I mean later. I said later. Because they yeah, should yeah, be available back. Monday. Yeah, do we... Has, has Have they said anything about when the elections are going to be yet? I haven't heard anything so, yet. I talked to a judge last week, and mm -hmm. they told me it was going to ha start happening around the end of the month. Okay. So they're so putting I'm, about a two-week delay on it. I think it was supposed to be, like, tomorrow. Yeah, but they they, they might open up submissions tomorrow. Because they, I haven't seen anything in the... Yeah. To, like, submit that I want to... They haven't put right. that up yet. Yeah, part of that is just dependent on when one of the senators wakes up. Yeah, so I'm, I'm assuming it's... Like yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that happens sometime this week, and then... It, Oh shit, speaking of, I need to fucking get a hold of Crane eventually to try to get my money back from the state. Oh, Crane's in the city right now. I just saw him earlier. Oh yeah, he is. Yeah, yeah I just saw him earlier. Because uh, fucking, uh, one of the judges just told me I need to get a lawyer to do it. And I'm just like, what the fuck? Then I talked to another judge and I'm like, no, you don't need to do all that. So I'm just like, alright, let me just fucking talk to Crane. Yeah, Crane's got access to the, the state account. As necessary. The issue I had is um, the state had been charging me fees for vehicles I never owned. Oh, weird. And it was for like four or five months. So I paying like 50 grand every two weeks instead of the 10K I was supposed to. Yeah. So on paper, just kind of like figuring out who can do it. Yeah. Hmm. Jesus. But, um, but yeah, uh, I got to change out of this silly outfit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you look good. Well, I was just, we were doing rock, paper, scissors before, and we were treating it like WWE wrestling. <laughs> so everybody had costumes and shit. And I was managing the Sultan of Sith, and this is how he dressed. So I love it. That's fantastic. Yeah, I got, I got like a big team, actually. Of people to help. That's awesome. Yeah, teacher, I've uh, a lawyer, Rosa Garta. She's a oh, I love deputy Rosa. mayor on yeah. my team. Yeah, should be great. Uh, I have Kirk Jenkins. Have you ever met him? Uh yeah, actually, uh, I helped him with a business proposal. Yeah, yeah, he's uh, him on board. He's a really good. Uh, he's on his street style. You know, he, he goes yeah, around yeah. talk to a lot of people and stuff. He's good. He's good people. Yeah, uh, he'll be good around. I know him. I'm putting someone else that I have on there. I have Mr. Scroofy, but uh, he's he's in Guantanamo Bay or Guantanamo Bay right now. Guantanamo. Okay. Yeah. And, and that's about it. And then I have a couple people for AU because what I want to do in the end is to have enough deputy mayors. But there's always someone awake, you yeah. know. Yeah. Coverage. Well, that was yeah. That was what I had tried to help Mickey do. Uh, when I first moved to the city was like finding the right people who could be around and uh, you know he he had mostly time like people right here in this time which was um, a problem because this is also when he's awake mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, and then he started disappearing from the city uh, and then uh, other than Ayub who was available kind of in the morning there was no one for NA and then, or, or, sorry for AU. And then he did yep. eventually hire two other people for AU, but it took them uh, like another month to actually get them hired. And by that time, they've only been on for like I don't know two weeks, and and it's already like the term's over. <laughs> like this. Yeah, no, the people had two people that run church at times. So if we we would have coverage all for AU. And then I usually come around toward you times. Mm -hmm. So UNA is, I'm here. And then I was telling him, I probably just need at least two or three for the storm. Yeah, definitely. And even if like it's not, even if they're not making super decisions, it at least allows for contact. 
Right. Yeah. And somebody someone else can make yeah. them and then they can, you know, okay, yeah, it's good. I talk to everybody. It's good. It may take the next day, but, you know. Yeah, but, but, but worst less case, than 24 they need hours. me to go yeah, and yeah. then they could give me a heads up and then I can yeah. go. And no, because the biggest like problem that. that happens in eight is that there's no one. It's not a matter of like them. It's that there is no one. No way for them to contact anybody. No one for them to reach. So they just feel like, you know, it's like when it comes to mayor, what's the point? And then they ain't gonna do shit for me. Yeah, uh, and there there are good people like the the at least one of the people that that I had um, suggested. Uh, his name's Dr. Kyle Avale. Um, if Mickey isn't allowed to run again, um, then I think Dr. Kyle had talked about maybe running again. But obviously, the the better bet for him, and this is something that I've talked to him about before. Since he's still trying to get his name out there is do the same kind of thing that he ended up doing for mickey which was concede and just partner up with whoever is going to be in, in in office he's very politically minded he's really good at his job and now that he's actually a deputy mayor he's got like the skill set to do that stuff and he's around starting like four or five hours from now all the way until like mid eu which is a like a really great time frame for someone who needs that kind of coverage. So yeah, like finding someone like that who who has that like commitment the majority of the days that they're going to be here and he's used to working overnights here at um Viceroy because he's a doctor. So like there there are people who are like that. It's just hard to find them. Uh, they're few and far between that are like at least I mean, clean. That's, that's pretty because that's three people you could have on the AU shift. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's perfect. Wait, so coverage. is he running for mayor next term? I, I don't know that he'll actually end up end up running. Uh, it, it'll be more one of those things that, like, if Mickey doesn't run, he'll find who he can align with because he's interested in politics. Yep. Ah, okay. Well, uh, next time you talk to him, you know, slip him me, you know? Yeah, absolutely. That, well, yeah, that's that's definitely... I think that's the best thing we can do. We need to actually hold deputy mayors accountable. Oh, for sure. If they're not cool. actually doing the job, you got to keep everything on the spreadsheet that people, you know, everybody hates doing paperwork. But when you keep on a spreadsheet, spreadsheets don't lie. True. Well, there. I mean, I don't, I don't mind in the work. I want to do the work. Yeah. That, that's why I'm trying to be mayor, you know? I, I will say that, like, the this job is one that does require a lot of administrative work, um, mm -hmm. which is something that a lot of people are not really ready for. Um, they think the mayor is going to be like a fun kind of position. Yeah. They do like a talent show. Right. And, and we've seen a lot of talent, right? Rami was a talent, but bunny beat him out. And she was actually really good for the city in the mayoral role because yeah, but she everybody was hated her. Everyone hated her, but she did the job so well. Still till this day, you hear, oh, bunny did nothing. And I tell you all the time, it's like, listen, I'll tell you the truth. I was 100% against, but he did the most that I've seen so far. I'm going to say it. Mickey? Who? Who, who did you say? Oh, Bunny. Oh, Bunny. Yeah. So far. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah. Not and even, no questions asked. And and the stuff like, I mean, I, I think Mickey's done a, a pretty fair amount too, but Mickey's. What Mickey did was he Mickey really self interest. It, it, absolutely. But Mickey learned very quickly. You can spend the money. And, and that's, that's what the biggest asset is to the city is putting money where people need money. So yep. the PD, I think was an interesting one. Cause obviously he spent money on like weaponizing the PD, which I don't personally agree with. It was a little, it was certainly excessive. Uh, um, he was trying to, he was trying to be all silly and shit. So I get it. Right. Exactly. Uh, but you think about like the number of businesses, like small businesses that would benefit from like seed investment from the state, uh, yep, like even grant programs. Bunny gave everybody a uh -huh. small business that asked for it. They gave them, she would give them a hundred K to help them stay afloat. And, and when Bunny left office after one term, there was $220 million at yep. the, at the end oh, of it. Shit. So she could have given far more than a hundred thousand dollars knowing yep. that that money is going to end back up in the state account, um, <laughs> or offload it into the Senate account. So, uh, Mickey has gone the opposite direction. I have seen numbers that crossed my desk 
of like upwards of eight or nine million where people are asking for seed money. And there's nothing to balk at because that's what the PD is asking for every month. And so like being able to seed, especially new companies that are like, they have heavy startup costs to buy a building oh, yeah. or, or renovate a building or whatever it may be, seed them that money. So they're not having to go grind for it. And oh, so they insane. can spend the time investing in people. Like those Look, are the things that I'd rather be. That's a big problem. I think people don't realize too, as someone who's for fuck's sake, the church, I had the bill from the, uh, and what people don't realize is a business is one person's dream. Right. So what ends up happening is like, yeah, you can hire whoever the fuck you want. It's not their dream. So no, they're not going to kill themselves to make it a reality. It ends up just being you. You're the burden. You get all the call for fuck's sake. I'll still pay fuck ton to keep the church afloat. Right. It's for people's dreams. It's just yours. And, and yes, especially with fucking storefronts being the that they are. I feel like it's a good app to, even if, even if it's not in the concept of like kind of the same thing he's saying there, but, you, but mixing with your idea of the market, right? There's people out there who want storefronts, have great ideas, have great business. They actually run their business with still not having a storefront. Those are the type of people that you should pull and help them. Like he just said, seed money to be mm -hmm. able to get that storefront going. Okay. Like a, like a business grant. Yeah. Cause Absolutely. now it is, it is straight up. Like it, it honestly is, who you know, if you know, yeah, you get in a business, if you know, that, you're um, getting the business. That that's actually, um, honestly, that, that, that could be a platform I could do like uh in the like in, like a a business and, and and we need breaking the goddamn monopolies another huge problem uh i have that already started to legislate for that i don't know that i would run on it as a platform no but no, if it's yeah, something that you yeah yeah no 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 i wouldn't run on it but but like if that's something that you wanted to push for inside your term i would absolutely back it uh because i've already started to draft an anti-monopoly like i the that is one thing that is killing other small businesses from being able to do anything. And it's keeping the people rich because they're the ones who all the shit. Well, they're just, yeah, they're just printing money. Isn't yeah. it, is it Cerberus that's the monopoly? No, oh, no, no. Well, it's Cerberus based, is one of them. big but gang. That's yeah, why, yeah. CGI, it's... Mandem mm -hmm. is, is another one. Mandem's huge uh, now. Seaside's got a, a pretty big mm -hmm. interest. Yeah, I mean, it, it really is like most of the gangs. And, and they're the one who control it, too. It's like right. yeah. what they do with business is what goes. That's why food storefronts popping up. It's because they all said, we don't need more food. Well, yeah, well, yeah, they was... have martinis and uwu and, right. and burger shop. Yeah. And if they give more, then those people are going to start losing money. I want to lose their money. Well, we definitely can't run on that because they're going to no, get No, no, they're pissed. saying you don't want to run on anything that against anybody who's making a fuck ton of money right now. Yeah, I mean, it, and it's fine. I think like this is this is kind of like the knowing the politics of the city. It's like it's fine to talk about things to each one of the people in the pockets that, that like is going to generate the most interest, right? So if you're going to gangs and, and pitching, um, defunding the police is a conversation to have uh but if you go to the pd talking about giving them more money or like at least keeping the same amount of money and uh like kind of like having that information is important um but when you get to a town hall keep it extremely vague right as soon as you get to be in the public forum with everybody you don't talk about any of those specifics at all and i think those are some of the issues that candidates get sucked into just their like immediate line of thinking and they stop thinking about what a very broad spectrum could look like for how their policy it is going to benefit the city. Bunny did a really good job because her platform that was broad was civilian population growth, right? I mean, feeding money back into civilians and helping businesses grow. And obviously it was good until Mickey won the popularity contest. Um, yeah. And, and if Mickey does get to run again and it's another popularity contest, by the He's way, win. Yeah. well, sort of, I've already started to, because I, I don't agree with more than two terms. Um, I, think, I don't either. I Me think neither. there's, yeah, I think there's something really wrong about it, especially since he's checked out. Um, I've begun having conversations with the powers that be to a legislate against it. And Speaking then this is Miller. 
Yeah, yeah, go go. I'll, I'll keep talking too. Um, but I have a conver- I had a conversation with uh, Mr. K at Chain Gang um, after Mickey backed out on the deal that he was having me broker for like fifteen million dollars to buy out the Jade Rings, and uh, and I was like, yo, like, is this the kind of person that you want to have in office? Uh, who's who's willing to back out on deals over like petty reasons? This is not either good business or be what's best for the city. Uh, and Mr. K was furious, uh, and he goes, he's trying to run for a third term, uh, and he goes, that's not going to happen. So like trying to ensure that even if this tries to happen, there's no ability for him to have the kind of majority he would need. Those are the, like, uh, you, I mean, to she work at the hospital. CG's already on the. They're they're voting for him to work for them. Yeah, that's good. So, you work here? I do I not know, unfortunately. I wanted to change. <laughs> I wish. Yeah, that's that's the best move right now. Having having CG on your side because they'll they'll pull a lot of votes, and then having them be able to pull on your behalf, right? If they go and and will uh, politic for you, so to speak. That that I don't know if they'll do because I don't I, you know I don't really want to bother too much. Sure. But I did ask one time, Mr. K. I was like, look, what you could do to help me, I'd appreciate it. like like that because he's yeah. he's done a lot for me, and he said he'll oh, try, but I, I don't know what that means, you know. <laughs> hey, I mean, if if they vote for you, that's enough because there's like 30 people in that organization. Yeah, I I mean, you'd be surprised how many people have said that. I I've been doing a lot of campaigning, I've gotten the mafia down. I've gone and see down the HOA. I to their boss sees and he says, fuck everybody that's running tired of the same people and he wants change. So he wants to vote for me. That's so that's great. them. I got the Pagos. Um, Is who, Pablo, uh, did Pablo decide not to run? I don't know, but I spoke to Carlitos today and okay. they all love me and they want to vote for because I promised great. them that I'd try to give them like, I mean, it's fucking happen but i told them i tried to give the jurisdiction there down there okay uh, it's not gonna f- happen but uh, i told them the I mean, truth you can try i'll try yeah, yeah. i told them i'd try I, I i was honest with them look i'm not gonna bullshit you i'll try but no promises and they're happy that um yeah putting in the i got the, the burger shop shelly said she'll vote for me some of them in there the clowns are gonna vote for me they said um uh, the hidden said vote for me uh, I'm missing a couple people. I'm I'm setting up a meeting to meet with the Saints leaders to to see what the kind of agreement I could go with them to see if they'll agree to vote for me. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, I, I've I've been you know doing the work. You know, I'm I'm trying really hard to get yeah. a bunch of people to vote for me. That's great. Yeah, your your name is definitely the one that I see probably the most consistently. Uh, the only other one that I think I've heard from personally is attendant. Um, but it sounds like he's mostly getting other people to um, be his voice for him. Yeah, but the problem with Tendent, I'm not going to lie, I didn't even know he existed until like <laughs> yeah. last week. And that right. against him is just, um, he he's nowhere. He's only a shrewd way. Yeah, he, I guess the, the shrug way backing could benefit him because everyone knows Joseph. And so if Joseph starts throwing his name around politically, that could be helpful. However, the flip side of that is Shrugway has a lot of enemies in the restaurants. So it could it could fire against him. Mm-hmm. But no, I mean, it sounds like the, the work you've been putting in is certainly the, enough to, to start pulling the vast majority away from Mickey. I will say your hardest battle, up, uphill battle, is going to be the PD. Because they I, love Mickey and the money. I don't think I'm going to win the PD. I know I could get a couple people. Yeah. A handful, maybe, to be honest. Uh, uh, but I don't. Oh, yeah. The the EMS and the doctors, they said they're going to vote for me as well. Um, but, um, if you, and, and this is just my personal suggestion, uh, and I don't know what the likelihood is of this happening, because, again, Pred loves mickey <laughs> well, um loves me i'm his partner but he gives pred, me ride along like good. hangs out with me all the time so pred is someone who pulls the majority of the pd um ear 
I'll say. Um, he has a lot of people on his side. Uh, so if you were able to kind of sneak that in and start going to some PD meetings and you talk about like how the funding that they've had under Mickey, they'll continue to have, but you'll be a more consistent present. Like, like you'll be in the city more and more available. And like, if you talk about like enabling their funding at, the, at least the same level or more, um, mm-hmm. and, and like the biggest thing that I think is probably going to be your biggest, um, value to them is Mickey doesn't pay them on time. So, so if you could say like, uh, not only will I be here to, to pay you, but I'll pay you when you need it. <laughs> so you never run out of money. Um, that would be an asset. And so, like, saying that to someone like Pred may, you know, pique his interest um, enough to, I don't know, at least have some of those those people start pulling votes. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll see next time I'll talk to Mr. Pred. But the, the, so what I've been doing to try to sway, because the cops love me. The cops mm-hmm. love me. What I've been doing is uh, during Tsunami, you know how they do that meeting? I'll mm-hmm. wait outside where the team lot is. Yeah, and I'll be out there and I'll say hi or to me, and I'll you know keep telling them, oh my name is Osvaldo, say hi or bye to me, and they'll say hi or bye to me. My thought yeah. process is on that is that they'll always think of me, and then voting comes up, they'll see my name and they'll just like instinctly just vote for me because they saw me, or they'll think, oh man, a funny guy out in the the parking lot, let me vote for him. Could be. Yeah, I mean you'll at some point you'll want to actually start going I mean, into it's those. A, it's PD a long days. shot, but it's something. Yeah. I yet to been able to get inside the PD. So you can you can three one one, um, especially after the voting times open, uh, or talk to Pred or whomever, and just say I want to meet with them. Emma does it a lot um, when when she's running. Uh, Mickey actually I think has like standing meetings. I've been with him to a few of them. Um, so yeah, just say like I'm running for mayor. You can three one one. I'm running for mayor want to come talk to everybody to, to like talk about my platform uh just make sure you've got it all written down or something so you can like do it as a leave behind they love you can actually put things on the screen behind them they love those kinds of things uh if you can show them something um yeah those are just things to be thinking through okay okay that's good to know good to know yeah all right this was good this was good good yeah, you think i have, I have a real chance of, of winning I do. I think if anyone has a real chance, it's probably you. <laughs> and and at the very least, uh, you have enough of a chance to make it so Mickey doesn't have the quote super majority. So if he has to have like 60% or more of the vote or whatever the number is, I don't know that he'll be able to get there with you running against him. Shit, do they have that much pull in the city? Well, I mean, like, it, it, again, most people can vote for multiple people right yeah so that's true so as long as people don't like vote for him and then not for another candidate um any any vote that they vote for you and for him is a wash and so like that's kind of the okay. mentality to have is like you you want to be at the very least you want to be the majority that outweighs mickey's lack of super majority Okay. Um, and this, this is like those, one of those unique instances where if he's allowed to run again, then the more pull you can have to make sure he doesn't have what he's legislated for the better. Um, alternatively, if the Senate comes back and say he can't run again, then I think you're pretty much a shoe in because your, your name, like even before I knew who you were, I knew who you were. Yeah. I've been, I've been campaigning thing like. Almost two months now. Like right when Mickey got to become mayor again, I started started campaigning for mines. Yeah, because uh, so I, I thought I, I thought I was gonna need as much uh, of a head start as possible. Yeah, I mean it's 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 mattered. People have noticed. They've they picked up on it. So that's that's been good. Do you think he's gonna be able to run for a third? I honestly, I think the way the Senate works. Uh, it's very possible that they would allow him. Yeah. Fuck. That's gonna be rough. I mean, you know how people move in this city. They like things when they're interesting. Guess. I'm not good at debates either. That's not gonna be great. 
uh, I will happily prep you on that stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna need a lot of help on that. <laughs> really bad. Things. If if it makes you feel better, uh, Mickey won the first election because before I moved into the city, I was a thought in his brain, uh, and I kept a copious amount of notes about things he promised so he could like call them back to mind. <laughs> Uh, so he had a little bit of an unfair advantage. <laughs> so I have, I have like pocket idea that I haven't really told people about. Mm -hmm. oh, or, I'm sorry. Yeah, I didn't yeah. know that you were still, I thought no, no, you no, were no, you're good, you're good. or whatever. Okay. Yeah. I just didn't want somebody trying to car or whatnot. So, you know, yeah, I appreciate it. If you need, we go get your repair kit. Cause you're probably going to one. Okay. Okay. I don't know um, who that is. She's a, she's a friend. Okay. Uh, Oh yeah, like a like a pocket thing that I want to, that I haven't been trying to tell people in the city yet. But so you know how the thing rifle, if you don't have a gun, because you can't use it, right? So people can't go thing anymore, pretty much. So I will make like a law where uh, hunting, because the hunting rifle doesn't hurt like you or me, right? So I wanted to try to make a law and put that on my platform as like a way of um of having it tied to your hunting license. That way, yeah, that way, you know, the rangers have something to do because, you know, they, they want to be up protecting the, the animals. And, you know, then the hunters get to do what they've always do, hunt. Because, like, like the owner, the own, because, yeah, so to the lost, I think I have the local boat as well. Because um, I talked to them and they told me that that's, they want that, but nobody listens to them. And right. I was like, well, I'm listening to you, and I will, I like that idea. Yeah. That's and then, um, yeah, yeah. The owners of the lodge, I guess, that sells the hunting, mm -hmm. they can't even go hunting. Really? Because they, yeah, they can't get the, can't get the guns license. So, like, how does that even happen? So that's, I feel like that's a good idea to do, you know? Yeah, definitely. Certainly a program to pitch to the Senate. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's, uh, that's what I'm hoping for and hoping if i a platform people will like that too you know yeah that's a good but one. i'm trying to low so it doesn't uh like people don't like send out and uh, steal it first. just in case if you need it because it has been slammed into a couple of times i stand by cops so that's i appreciate it yeah no it's our fault thanks emt I lady like, i feel like that's that would be a good one you know but i just felt like i was interrupting on a conversation that oh, i you're... seem to be interrupting on because i know he's running for mayor and stuff and things and he has my vote yeah oh uh, good, 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 good. yeah i don't, I don't I think we've so. met i'm sloan kelly good to meet you oh not meet you. i'm jenny i'm jenny jones good to meet you oh. jenny yeah. no it's kind of slow today it's a big court case going on i don't know do you remember alex bones i don't remember alex bones it's uh i was here for alex bones Take a yeah, program. well, it's his court court case. They're they're going them right now, so oh, yeah. that's uh, an interesting time. I don't know if I was here. I, for, both I, I don't think I've ever met an Alex Bones. I think you. Well, I think yeah. you guys like cross paths uh, here at the hospital, but maybe this was like last year or the year before. Oh, this was like a month ago. <laughs> oh, oh, then yeah, maybe yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's uh, it's gonna be interesting. You probably should check it out as well. <laughs> I, I might, I might. All right, hey. Yes, I sip you. Nice meeting you. Well, I already know you. <laughs> I'm, I'm meeting oh, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I thought that was a good one. I just keep it in my pocket, though. Nobody yeah. knows. Yeah, definitely any ideas like that that are, like, things people don't talk about liberally are really great platform ideas. Um... Things that are like going to be unique to the city, especially if they're things that you will like offer to people as like businesses that they can take on um, or ideas that people could like take ownership of that you don't want to like manage yourself. Like those are those are great ways. Like um, when I first came into the city, I like was, like really prided myself on working with um, just people who didn't really know how to formulate ideas into business proposals and um, would kind of hear out like, oh, I'm interested in uh, doing something that would like benefit us to get more materials. 
and and like what you know what listening to just kind of different ways that they could possibly get more materials or uh as a civilian i don't have a way to protect myself uh and so i, I want to think about how to do that and so like putting on paper those ideas and rather than and this is actually something you, you see kind of a lot um hey Dessel. Uh, sure. hey Mites. uh how you doing i'm all right you know for me right well I come still on. need to get come that on. stuff for you about our needs and things for your platform actually oh yeah 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 well then you have my number no i do i think hold on if not, it's in the yellow page. Send it send it over to me uh, where you have it. Okay. Kiki, take me flying again. Oh, yeah. yeah sure. Don't you fucking forget, you hear me? Don't you fucking forget. No, I don't forget. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, you okay, Mintessa? You look... Uh, next week. Just uh, most of you. the week. Oh, my God. I am, so, I am so sorry, Mintessa. Uh, most of the week. You most... Look, uh, um, what happened? I've got a lot of stuff. Feel better? Uh, me. No, I was asking. I was just asking. You never know. You the... back. It'll hurt, but I'll do it. No, you won't. I will. You won't? <laughs> Ow. Uh, I mean, you kind of deserved it. Uh, it hurts. Oh. That's what you get. That's fair. Yeah. Here's your hand, you guys. Sorry, Mitesa. No, okay. Okay. All right. I told you what happened. What did we learn? I learned not to fuck around and find out. Mitesa, no. Uh huh. Her glasses. My glasses. Here we go. Got him. Good. Oy. Uh, but yeah, how about Wednesday? Yeah, it sounds good. Okay. Better. No. <laughs> All right. I hope you feel better. Tessa, do you need food? Thank you. Huh? Do you need any food? Um, if you got anything vegetarian, I won't say no. I do have vegetarian stuff. There you go. I have a ton of food. Oh, these just look spicy. Uh oh. Wait, spicy. Oh, are they the yeah, chips? They're, right? Yeah, they're the, they're the chips. Ooh. <laughs> Maybe avoid the chips. Have I seen? There's. They are have hot. you seen my mayor website? No. Oh, you should go to it and look at it. You guys all should. It's called. It's you on the. Website? Yeah, it's I made great. a website. It's a great. Go website. to it. Go to vote.cuban.army. What do you guys think? Oh, it's great. What was that? <laughs> no, I'm just reading it. Hey, sorry. The mayo me off. I wasn't expecting it to be spinning. Oh yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be distributing that mayo soon in the city. Mayo from the I like it. See, see, see. Isn't it great? It's wonderful. Did you oh. See, of course. You're so t I love it. I, I like it. Don't you isn't it? It is. Yeah. Good, Reminds good, me yeah. of like early two thousands. What are you trying to? It's it's like a. It's nostalgic. It's, I'm saying it's what? very you. It's got a very MySpace People like kind of vibe. It's a it's a state of the art website. State of the art. Yeah. I paid Go Dandy a million dollars to make that web to have that website. Go Dandy. Oh, well, it's it's fabulous. Oh, okay. One good. similar when I was on Neop. Back in like 2001. <laughs> you said Neopets? What the f? How are you making yeah, fun that's of me? How I learned web to well, No, what? I'm. <laughs> it's good, I'm saying. I'm so hard on that website. No, no, I didn't it's go good. to sleep. I didn't go to sleep for a week. It as an like, literally, people love nostalgia as well, though. What? It's a state of the art website. Yeah, I know. You did it in a way that. People think, oh man, the good old days, and so they're gonna kind of vote for you. Can I choose my own music? Days. Can I put on some old Fallout Boy? 
You know, side note, I actually put some music on there, but it wasn't working. Ah, <laughs> oh, I mean, music is really difficult sometimes, I think. I gotta but put on gonna the have clear a, letters. Eventually, I'm gonna have videos there of me just doing speeches. It's gonna be great. I love it. I can't Wait, tell if you're doing name? serious or not. No, 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 no. Oh, never mind. Nope. No, 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 no. I I haven't go to it while I'm. Yeah, 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 yeah. I haven't. I keep forgetting to change the link because I did that as a joke. Yeah, I haven't. I haven't fixed it yet. It's fixed very quick. Don't, 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 just don't. Yeah, I completely forgot. I completely forgot. I thought I, I thought I this. Oh, that's I forgot to do. It's okay. I realized what it opened, I closed it very quickly. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fantastic. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, I, so the, what the link is supposed to go to, picture of me in the White House. White House. Oh, that's cool! That, yeah, that's what it's supposed to go to. I just, uh, yeah. Soon, soon, soon TM. You know, the fact that the mayor doesn't have a house in the city is... Kind of surprising. What? Oh, like a, a like house. a mayor house? Like a mayoral house, yeah. Mm, I don't know. It'd be kind of difficult, wouldn't it, to just constantly transfer a house to somebody else? I don't know. Isn't it just like handing over think the so? state ID? Just sell it for like a dollar. Yeah. <laughs> sell the house for a dollar? Yeah. Yeah, like for each person. Like that's how I get my cars, yeah. like for free. They paid like a hundred grand. And then they were like, here is for you. Well, Give me a dollar. A different. No. No. <laughs> Same thing. Same, I mean, similar uh, principle. Wrangler, Wrangler gave me the gave me key to the house. I mean, if like a senator owned it, for instance, and then you just Oh, and then just keys. gave it to the mayor. Yeah. That makes a little bit more sense. Well, th you can take about, like, it. That's can you how take keys in. from people? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. So why doesn't a senator... That's literally something we should pose once you're in office. Mm -hmm, yeah. mm -hmm, the state mm -hmm. should, instead of two hundred and twenty million good. dollars going Actually, to a yeah. yacht, we'll we'll have them buy the mayor a house. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, let's every go time a new mayor gets in office, they can uh, pay more for interiors with state of funds to <laughs> there, there you go. No, 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 yeah. no, 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 not state funds. Well, it's the economy. Well, well, you could. Not say the funds. I'm not biased or anything. I just for more interiors. It's okay, true. so you are biased. She's also very talented, so they would be lucky to have her. Okay. Okay, yeah. I, I don't see why not. Of course. Sure. I'm gonna go over to Maldini's and get someone who got set fire. Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye. I love that Ricky's Anyway, uh, Osvaldo, uh, this is a great chat. I need to run for a little bit. I did text you my email, so feel free to yeah, uh, I got send me a, a quick a quick note. Uh, and then uh, I will be around if you need me. I don't know if Bunny's coming back, uh, but we'll figure out some time. We can reconvene, have a full-on discussion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we could uh, talk about them. What was I going to say? Just uh, yeah, just let me. I, Monday will probably be a good date. We can't do it today, but uh, okay. yeah. Cool. Just, let, just keep me in, cause I'll, I'll just if I'm if I don't respond or anything, that means I'm asleep. But uh, I'll, okay. I'll respond. Fair enough. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll check with her, see what her schedule looks like for Monday, and then we'll uh, we'll try and shoot for Monday at the latest. All right, uh, I sent you. Uh, a thingy on the email okay all right i'll Got see it. you soon my friend absolutely appreciate you, need, you. do you need a ride thing no, no no i'll uh i'll find a bush to go nap in oh okay okay all right appreciate you i uh, appreciate you too, my friend you taught yeah. me a lot today good good i hope so yeah i learned a lot very quickly about the politics of the city so the more i can do to help all right my friend hey man Ooh. we'll talk soon All right, chat.
That was actually, I didn't realize that was going to turn into a politics conversation, but I'm glad it did. We'll uh, go ahead and call it here. Appreciate you all. Uh, might be around tomorrow, but we'll catch you in the next one. Love y'all.